UFC 165 Jones versus Gustafsson was September 21st, 2013 at the Air Canada Center in Toronto, Canada. It was the sixth UFC light heavyweight title defense for John Jones, and it was the first UFC light heavyweight title shot for Gustafsson. John Jones was on a nine fight win streak. He was undefeated. And Gustafsson was on a six fight win streak. This fight ends up being an absolute war. I just don't believe that the public was ready for what was gonna actually unfold that night. Here we go! First round, Alexander Gustafsson definitely caught me off guard. You know, his footwork was uh, surprising. Um, you know, I felt as if his kickboxing was a little bit better. Good striking by Gustafsson here. Good movement, good striking. And you're like, wow, Gustafsson's starting to really get after him. Gustafsson has a lot of power in his right hand. Oh, and there's that right hand. That's what I was talking about. The crazy thing, I think what blew everybody away, is when Alexander took John Jones down. People couldn't believe it, you know, and everyone in my house, we, 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 were, we were shocked. It was unbelievable. Finish the round, baby, 20 seconds. Nine, finish the round. He was winning the fight, and, you know, that was something that was new to me to be losing uh, right away. Final seconds of the round. Big elbow. The thing that made this fight such a great fight, the first time John Jones had ever been taken into deep water, ever. This has been the most he's ever been hit inside the octagon. I was going crazy during this fight. I, I was literally going, this is one of the greatest fights I've ever seen in my life. Gustafson matches up better than anyone who has ever fought John Jones before. This is a very competitive fight. We are headed to the championship rounds. Round by round, I was like, man, Gus, Gus has this so far. I was beating him up the whole fourth round. Smooth boxing by Gustafson. The thoughts of losing my belt kind of crossed my mind, and and uh, that just that gave me an added motivation. 45 seconds left in round four. And there's a nice elbow. Caught him. The impact from the arm and Alexander actually putting his head down, it's like taking a baseball bat and hitting another baseball bat. John digs deep, and John is trying to finish the fight. And again with a big elbow. Gustafson is hurt. Incredible fight. Incredible fight. You found out exactly who John Jones was, and you found out that he is the champion. Both of these guys are pushed to their limit in this fight. What an incredible title fight. Gustafson fought him tooth and nail. Gustafson took him to the edge of the bridge, and John wouldn't allow him to push him off of it. And Champion of the world! At the end of the night, it ended up being the greatest UFC light heavyweight title fight of all time. Jones and Gustafsson is taking its rightful place in the UFC Hall of Fame. The greatest UFC light heavyweight title fight ever.